Hello everyone, hope you're well. Today, I've been messing around in the garage and I've found this. Now we've had this years. I bought this so we could go, you know, when we went camping. Um, you know, years ago, we had a really old caravan then and uh, we had electric cook up and they used to cook in the awning and, and, and we bought this for that reason. Now I know these are all the range all the rage now aren't they it's um induct it's induction induction ob well I'll say we've had it so long um oh, it must be 15 year old silver crest oh data manufacturer 7 2009 so so this year it'll be 14 year old so it's, it's quite an old one i mean i know a lot of people think they knew but we've had this a long time and it's rated to 1800 to 2000 watt. Now I know my mate Steve might be interested in this and he mentioned one ages ago, but I couldn't find mine. I, that's, it's it, as I say, we've got camping gear and it's, it's stuff all got moved around in the garage. Now I know it don't look brand new, but that's the reason it doesn't look brand new because it's not. But now then I want to get you the controls in the picture, don't I? Right, now what we'll do, these will only work with a steel pan, and I'll show you, because we've got an aluminium pan here. I suppose everybody already knows this. Um, right, let me plug this in, to get the right plug. I'm plugging the Kasori in, look. There we go. I'll just put a little drop of water in there, but I know it's not going to work. Now then, we'll switch it on. And that gives you the temperature, level five. Straight away, look, the fan starts up, but it won't switch on. Now, when I first bought it, I thought it was faulty, but it's... I suppose everybody knows this. Turn that off. It's an aluminium pan, it won't work. What you need is a steel one, like our frying pan. Now, just to show you, let's plug this in the mains now. And once again, I've set the meter to 33 pence. Reset it and it's on 33p. So we'll plug that in. And what I was thinking was, we'll get a pint of water I think that's probably the easiest measurement to use, isn't it? Can we see that pan all right? Yeah, we can. Yeah, we can. Let me just get a pint of water and I'll bring you back. Yeah, maybe the frying pan's not the best choice, but as you can see, there's a pint of water there. And we'll tip that in there. And we'll see how long that takes to boil. Uh, yeah, we'll switch it on. Up to the highest level, 10. Right, and that will obviously count on the meter. You can see it's counting now. And we'll see how long that takes to boil. I mean, if, if you're all sitting there watching this, it's never, it's never going to boil, is it? I don't know whether you can see it's on level 10 there. Let's take the camera out so you can see better. Oh, a bit of finger there in the way. As you see, I've got it on level 10, which is the maximum. And the gauge is counting. Let me get it in the shot. Let's put it on the cost. 12.31 watts. Let's have a look. It's a high of 1237, yet it's rated at 2000, but I'm sure I've got that for long. Yeah, I have. Now that's a surprise. Oh, I'm coming out terrible with this camera. Yeah, it's only gone up to that, but we'll see if that increases. 
we've used nearly a penny look in how long is that almost three minutes look oh so it looks as though that's running about a penny for three minutes oh, i didn't know this i've got to be honest this is news to me but uh well, there's a bit of that's getting more and more ready. There's a bit of movement in there. Actually, I could keep the camera running, couldn't I? And then speed it up when we come to the uh, editing. As you can see, it's already steaming. Yeah, it's got a timer on as well, look. I'm just here on that button, but I'll be honest, I just use it as it is and, and you know we, we cook whatever we're cooking and that's it now we're starting to get some movement there you can see it starting to bubble i think we've been on four minutes let's just have a look yeah that says just over four minutes Yeah, hang on a minute, four minutes. And what was the cost? The cost is 1.8 pence. Oh, I told you wrong there. That was 0.1. So it looks to me as though it's running five minutes is about 2p, look. Four and a half minutes is 2p. Oh. Oh, well, we all live and learn, look. They're now, that's coming up to a rolling boil now, isn't it? Now, when will we class that as a boil? Not yet. Let it go a bit longer. It's steaming well. I don't want to put the extractor on yet because it's a bit noisy. I think, really, if you were boiling water, you wouldn't use the frying pan, would you? But it just gives you an indication of how quick it is. Now would we class that as a boil? Now let it go a bit longer. We're in no rush. It's five and a half minutes almost. Would you class that as boiling Wendy? What do you reckon? That's boiling isn't it? It looks like it's simmering, but I think it is Yeah, boiling, I'll tell you what, you won't want to put your finger in there. boiling over. No, bubbling well, that is. Oh, well, let it go a bit longer. Yeah, we're all right. We're getting the tea ready for tonight. Wendy's doing the chopping and that while I'm while I'm playing See, about with this. I do do something. You do a lot. I think everybody realises that. <laughs> Well, that's got to be boiling. Come on, it's not looking any difference for the last minute now. And as you see, that's used three pence. So that's, I'm quite surprised at that. And that's in six minutes there. So that's pretty good really, isn't it? So let's just have another look. As I say, it's classed as 2000 watt. But on there, the wattage is only Maybe not the max maximum. Let's have a look. Kilowatts use 0.1 of a kilowatt as your voltage, amperage, and the wattage. Oh, what was the amperage? What was it? There it is. Five amp. Right. So that's running at about five amp. Is that correct? I'll have to think about that one. Yeah, 1237 watts. It's been on seven minutes now. It's not going to boil any more than that. There's no top on this. I mean, that's been boiling for a couple of minutes. So I reckon five minutes. So I'll turn that off now. There we go. And it stops. I mean, it's instant with this. And we'll take this pan off now. But obviously, it's going to be hot, isn't it? Because you've got heat transfer. 
mean, you take that when can you've you got the can kids you take camping, that off, don't we? Because can you take that off me? Take the water away. We take it when we take the kids camping. Or That's going to be all. Yeah, we do. Oh, yeah. They, they, we've took this when we've all gone out together and camp. I mean, look. <clears throat> that's up mate but it's not burning not mate burning so but much. it goes cool quick yeah we take this when the old family goes they all, they've all used it from time to time a flame. yeah and i don't like using the little gas bottles because it chews them up in no time so anyway that just to show you that really so i hope this has been some use to somebody and those gas bottles are quite expensive yeah they are they? i know i see people using them in the kitchens they think they're cheap to run but that's not that's not the way I've looked at it. Anyway, well, let me just show you. You see, because it's plugged in, it's still counting down the time now. Now, I was hoping that had stopped, so I'll probably have to reset it when we cook the dinner to give you an accurate reading. But, uh, yeah, it's only 1,200 watt, and I thought it was higher than that. It says 2,000 on the bottom, unless I'm going crazy. And that has boiled that water for less than four pence. And I'd say it were near a three because it was bubbling for quite a while. And it's and it's not a kettle, is it? It's just a pan. Right, so we'll leave it at that for now. Now, we're having a curry tonight, and I'll do it in the frying pan. So we'll Ch cook it on here. Chinese curry. Yeah, Chinese curry, but it's... A fake. Yeah, curry. well, I'll come back to you on that one for now. We're just looking at this. Okay, see you later.